Hello and welcome, my name is Matej Jan, but you can call me Retro, and this is the first Retronator pixel art paint over. Extent of the Jam asks, what's the first things you do to improve this image? Is this image of a lovely car? And Louis Gornfeld, Extent of the Jam is also a very good cheap tune musician, so you're listening to his music in the background. Let's get to it. First of all, Louis, when you're enlarging pixel art, make sure to not use interpolation. If you look at your image, you see how blurry it is, so enlarge with no interpolation and only use whole integer, so 200%, 300%. Second, I'm gonna get rid of this D3 ring over here, because the car is, has a very smooth, shiny metal surface, and D3 ring kinda conveys a little bit of more of a texture, so let's just get rid of that. Now I'm improving form of the car itself, I'm looking at the reference and making the edges a little bit more pronounced. And here's a little lesson from figure drawing. If you draw all of the outlines in kind of a one connected line, the whole result will look pretty flat. But if you overlay the lines one over the other where the form is going over the other, it will convey this kind of 3D structure. The same holds for non-organic things, so for example in the car you should have things be clearly what goes in front of the other, uh, whereas you see in your example if you just use an outline around the silhouette it's very flat 2D. One last trick is never to join lines in one point, so you should, this is again to convey 3D structure and you'll see right now that if all of them connect in the same kind of point there's no information what goes in front of it so try to avoid that. I'm not sure if you were intentionally uh, using some kind of constraints on what colors you're using but I'm gonna go and paint it over with a little bit more desaturated colors. Now the reference you chose is very hard to read because there's lighting coming from all over so I'm gonna first find another image of a car in a similar position in similar color uh, it's a lotus that I'm gonna use as lighting reference. So from the neutral color now I'm first adding the shadows, looking at the reference and the same goes for highlights and I'm gonna do that uh, half shine, half in the dark, split going down the middle, it looks really nice and that's it. Here's where we started with and here's my paint over and this has been the first Retronator pixel art paint over and see you next time.